Where are you going for your next train, James? I've got to go to Knapford Yard and then to Wellsworth Scrapyard of all places. Apparently there's some military things going on there. Odd. Does it have anything to do with what we heard last night? Beats me. I asked the station master what's in it and he doesn't even know. Just some tech. I don't like the amount of odd jobs we've had to do for Boomer and his military. Scrap runs, strange machines. What is it all for? Come on, Gordon. You know it's for our safety. Maybe. Every government has its secrets, but none like this. It's too... large scale. Whatever's going on at Blue Mountain, I want to find that out. Well, good luck trying to get there. I was talking to Scarlova the other day, and he said that the base has been blocked off by all engines that aren't owned by the military. Well, that's just about everyone. Yes, there's something those diesels are up to. Question is, what? Hello, Gordon. Hello, Mr. Hugh. What are you doing here? I'm glad you asked, Gordon. Feel free to take the rest of the day off. This engine here will be taking your express back to Knapford, as well as for the rest of the day. What, sir? Yes, the general wanted to see about changing up our express engine with a diesel and see how it goes. No disrespect, sir, but what does the general know of railways? He runs an island full of them. His say is final. This is preposterous. What am I supposed to do while I wait here? You wait here like a good engine. Now I've got to get back to Knapford. I'll see you all later. I told you they'd be after your job next. I don't want to hear it, James. What does the general want me taking off at the express? Beats me. Hey, maybe he needs you up at Blue Mountain doing whatever. If that's the case, I guess you get to go up after all. Yes, that's what worries me. Alright, I've stayed long enough. I gotta get going. I'll see you later tonight, Gordon. That is, if you aren't called away first. See you later. What do they need with this shipment? I think to get my TARDIS. If its systems are down, they could go in and lift her up and transport her out of here very easily. We need to get to it before they take it somewhere else. How do we get in there without being seen? My contact said he's already inside the encampment. He'll meet us at the east entrance and take us in. You managed to contact him and get a response in less than 12 hours? I told him we needed it quickly. How do you know it's not a trap? We don't. You don't have to come. You've done enough for me already. And I don't want to endanger you any more than you already have. If Boomer gets his hand on your TARDIS thing, it could spell disaster. He already has one thing of alien origin at his disposal, and another would be disastrous. Okay, just be careful. Richard? You're my contact? Why would you do that? Do you know how dangerous it is for you and her? We know the risks, but I've seen what Boomer's been doing. Up at Blue Mountain, the machines he's created, what he's done to the engines, it's all there. That's where we need to go to stop him. It all started with that thing we found all those years ago. Everybody hands up, now! Well, if it isn't Hatch Children, together at last. I expected better from you, Richard. 
all that snooping around and going behind my back. I should have your head for the copious amounts of treason you've pulled. Now who are you, little missy? A new girlfriend of yours? I heard we pulled someone from that blue box who went missing last night. Would that be you by any chance? See, here's the thing. I don't really know. Being thrown about and knocked out, it doesn't really do well for your brain. No matter. I'll get what I need out of you yet. You'll be very useful when it comes to deciphering what B-127 is. The rest of you, however, will be taken in for questioning. Kill the traitor. No! No! You can't! Yeah. Ah. Ah. Who are you, really? Glad you asked that again. I'm the Doctor. I'm from the planet called Gallifrey in the constellation of Cerberus. I will protect this planet and any other planet that needs my help, and you, my good sir, have caused quite enough trouble on this island. See ya! What happened? You are my TARDIS. I guess you got all fixed up and came back. Good job, girl. It was on the other side of the scrapyard? How'd it get here? I guess a psychic link. She did before, but... Anyway, we should get going and save Charlie. How? You saw. Just need to dematerialize and we can go anywhere. Cross fingers. What do you mean, cross fingers? She can sometimes be a bit temperamental. Now let's get out of here. <laughs>